Good evening and good morning for your, uh, if, if it's morning where you are and, and, and good afternoon, but right now it's evening and it's about, uh, there it is, almost uh, 20 minutes to 12 a.m. And I am at a special hotel. I guess it's special. It's special for me because I've never used Hotel Tonight the app Hotel Tonight before. And what you're gonna see is a room that was booked uh, around 3.30 p.m. today on the app. And I am at the U Hotel on Fifth Avenue. It's a boutique hotel, not terribly large. And uh, let's go see what it's all about. I'm in room 408, and uh, again, this room is equipped with a uh, a site, uh, uh, you know, a site, impaired uh, site uh, signage, uh, as you can see. Can you see it? Yeah. And I'm in room 408, just a boutique hotel. There's the elevator. I'm right close to the elevator, so that's nice. Okay, let's get in and see what it's gonna be. Okay, I've got the green light that's gonna enable me to open the door. Where's the light? All right, light switch. Oh, the air is on. Maybe they prepped the room. Maybe they knew I was coming and they turned on the turn on the air so let's start this and get this over with uh, I'm in Manhattan New York City this is nice I always like that that's a real safety see what that does if you open the door this mechanism here will keep the door uh, from opening see that Looks very simple, but a very smart man engineered that because it has to be just right. It looks like a piece of metal bent in a in a in an oval type shape and, and, and a hook. But believe it or not, for that to be effective, it has to be manufactured and designed just right. I've got some interesting artwork here. I really don't know what that is, and of course, it's got a up-to-date and accurate fire evacuation plan. I've got two views, because I'm on the corner unit. Uh, I guess I should have two views, we'll see. Okay, let's move in. So we got a full-length mirror right off the bat. Very nice. Let's see if we can get some more light in here. Okay, some more light. Let's get the, I guess let's get the bathroom. Let's do the bathroom first. We don't need the blower. It does have a blower, which is very nice. It's equipped, uh, looks like marble shower. It's a stand-up shower. Very nice. My God, you don't know how happy I am that I don't have to look at a 99 cent uh, plastic inserted tub, which are all the rage. It's got a bowed uh, shower curtain, which is very nice. Uh, soap holder, very good, and a mat, very nice. Let's see what the pressure is right off the bat without getting my camera equipment wet. <sighs> wow, that's a pretty strong current right there for you. A pretty strong current. Satisfied, satisfactory, satisfied. I like the grips. I like the grips. A lot of people say, oh, I don't want those handicap uh, hold bars in my shower. Believe me, you do. Because when you take a shower, often you're in different moods. Maybe you've just finished exercising or jogging. Maybe you, uh, the party last night lasted into the early morning. You're tired, you're fatigued. There's nothing like a hand grip 
just to put your hand while you're in the shower. And uh, in the event that you do, in fact, lose your balance, you've got something that's going to save you uh, from gravity taking over. So I like it. I like it a lot. Very nice. Uh, I even have, uh, well, I'll get to that. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. They're happy I'm here. Look at that. They are definitely happy I'm here. Look at that. If I measured that with a T-square or a, a 90 degree angle ruler, I bet it would be almost completely even and exact. So somebody took the time to take the time to give this the time it's that's needed. This was just this just wasn't an afterthought. This just wasn't thrown together in a rush in a heat. This was a task that that took time and was thoughtful in its accomplishment. I mean, come on, come on, can you see it? All right, they got towels above the commode, which is uh, the rooms in uh, New York City kind of are kind of tight. So there's no way that they could get around positioning these towels anyplace else. So I'm not going to dock any points for that. I've got an extra uh, roll of toilet paper. I've got some face cloths, it looks like, that are very, very neatly uh, folded. Again, this is something that's just not thrown together. I am impressed. I like the glass shelving, too. I always, I'm always impressed when I see glass shelving. And you can see it right there. Uh, it opens up the room. It gives the room more space. Uh, there's a lot of tricks that a hotel or a hotelier can uh, uh, to incorporate in their hotel room design to make the space seem that much larger. Uh, let's do this. Let's get it over with. What are we dealing with here? Crane. Crane is a very popular brand. Crane Plumbing. I've seen it before. They're not a fly-by-night organization. They've been around. They're, they're up there with uh, Cola and uh, American Standard. I've seen Crane. They're, they're, they're a respected uh, company in the plumbing industry, no doubt. Let's see what we're going to get here. Very good. Very robust. Very robust. A lot of water, high volume. Again, we're not in California. And uh, that bowl was very, uh, uh, very excited to flush whatever needed to be flushed. It just looked like it took its job serious with effortlessly. And uh, there it is. Now let's go over to the sink area. Your standard soap, which is nice. And a soap dish. A mirror. Look at the mirror. Can you see the mirror? Let's see if it's got two ways. Oh, yep. They got a close-up, too. See the close-up? Can you tell if it tell you to? Yeah, you can tell. See, I'm close now. Now I'm far. Close, far. So that's nice. That's a double mirror. Uh, women like those mirrors uh, because they want to see close to their face sometimes. The waste paper basket's got a new bag in it, which is beautiful. And it's up in the air just to show the new occupant of the room that it is empty and it is new tissues. What do we have? We have uh, lotion. We have uh, shampoo. And we have conditioner. I don't use conditioner. I'm not that fussy about my hair. I don't think I need conditioner. I don't think I want to go that far. You know, that would be like somebody putting a, maybe a spoiler on their automobile. If it's just a regular automobile, do you really need a spoiler? You really need an aftermarket spoiler on a on a Vega, or a, 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 and a, a, you know a, a Taurus. I mean, all right, what's over here? This must be the blow dryer. I can feel it through the bag. That's a blow dryer. That's very nice. It's right there. Space is limited in these hotels. Let's see what pressure we got. Oh, very nice. Can you hear it? Can you hear it? That's some good pressure. The room is immaculate. The bathroom is anyway. Let's see if I can uh, give you a view. Since I have a corner room, let me try to lift this up. 
I don't want to. What you want to do is you want to. Okay. I mean, I'm trying to. I'm trying to get the. Uh, I'm trying to. There it is. When you, when you, when you, these blind, these blinds are kind of heavy. So what you want to do is you want to put your hand in the middle of the blind and kind of hold it up while you pull the string. And that's why I had some problems because I'm holding this, uh, uh, the Brian Red Band joystick, not joystick, uh, uh, selfie stick. Anyway, this is the view, not a bad view. That's Fifth Avenue. And, um, and uh, what is it down there? What does it say? I gotta put my glasses off. East 35th Street and 5th Avenue. So you know where I am. You better come armed because I'm not going out. I'm not going out. I'm not gonna go out. I'm not gonna be taken alive. I'm not going out easy. So if you wanna come and, and mix it up, you wanna throttle me up, you better be prepared because I can throttle up too. I can, thr I can go zero to 60 in a matter of seconds. Faster than a BMW in a damn BMW commercial. How's that? Okay, so there it is. That's the that's the bathroom. I think we're done in the bathroom. Let's get out of here. Nice shower curtain. Very nice. Full length. This is be a beautiful shower if I said I just a beautiful space. Okay, it even has a door. See that? And that closes there. Alright, now let's get some lights on over here. Where's the light switch over here? There is the light switch. Oh, there it is. Wow, it's got a dimmer. So it's gonna go, it's gonna go. See the dimmer switch on there? Right there. All right, we got a remote, we got two waters and he gave me two more when I checked in. Take me to New York. Well, you're already here and this is the room. This is the room, let's try the bed. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. My fit, the bed is very good, adequate. I'm only gonna be here one night. Look at this. There it is. This is unbelievable. This is a wood frame. I don't think we've seen, we've seen the standard metal frame once, but we've never seen, this is like, this is very, very Asian, uh, Asian-esque or rustic. Maybe uh, cowboyish, but this is a wood frame. It's got the same supports, but look at it. Now I may not even use this in this hotel room, but I will display it just because I like looking at it. You know, I might put my bags in a closet. Do I have a closet? I don't even know if I have a closet. I don't even think I have a closet. Anyway, I will, uh, I'll, I will display it. Another waste paper basket, nice little writing area. And, uh, uh, this phone does have a speaker. Let's see. Hold on now. Hold on. See, I'm having trouble with this. I can't do two things at the same time with this. Hold the... Uh, the camera or the iPhone Max Pro 12 Max Pro and work the phone at the same time. Okay, it's ringing. It's on speaker now. Hello? Do you have a Bible in the room? Okay, thank you, sir. Okay, I was told that there is no Bible in the room. I don't know why I couldn't get it. Uh, the speakerphone to work. It, the, 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 the red light lit up. Oh, there it is. So you hit that first before you... Oh, I see. There it is. I'm sorry, I'm just checking the phone to see if it's working properly. Oh, okay, no problem. Thank you for everything. You're welcome, thank you. Okay, so the, the, everything's fine. Uh, I, I, I picked the phone up first and then hit zero. And that's why you didn't hear the speakerphone at the same time. I like a phone with a speakerphone. It lets your hands be free and uh, it's just wonderful. So this is the hotel, if you haven't already known. 
373 Fifth Avenue Hotel. I'm in room 408. Bring it on. Bring it on. And uh, this is a nice little writing desk with a pen and, uh, and some paper. I mean, this is all you need. This is all you need. What do you, what do you want? You don't come to New York to stay in your hotel room. Uh, nice size uh, Samsung. Samsung. Those Koreans are really coming on like gangbusters. Uh, uh, the anti-fire uh, device or sprinkler device. Uh, smoke detector, carbon dioxide uh, 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 indicator. So that's good. And the bed area. And that's it. That's it. Where to get this? There it is. So there's the room. That's how big the room is. That's it. Now you're probably wondering how much this room costs. Look, I've even got some, is this live? No, it's fake, it's fake, but it's, it's, it's a good thought. The thought is there. It's a no smoking room, thank you. And this is the view. Oh yeah, bring it all the way up. Bring it all, I like that, I like a chain. Yeah, that's a chain. And then it has a window, is that, what is that window there? Oh, wow, look at that. So I can listen to the cars as they go by and the buses and the trains and the bicycles and the scooters and the joggers and uh, the uh, the embraviated and uh, the sirens, the fire trucks and the fire, you know, all the sounds that make the city what it is. And it's just wonderful. It's like the ocean. A lot of people like to uh, sleep and listen to the ocean. On the same token, the sounds of the city, look at it, can you hear it? That's it. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is, there it is. That's one vehicle you don't wanna be in. So there it is. And it's just a small boutique hotel. So that's it. That's the room. Uh, four pillows, a couple of throw pillows. You know, that's why they make sofas. If they didn't have sofas and beds, all the pillow manufacturers would go out of business. Pillows. You ever go to somebody's house and there's 15 pillows on the couch? Get the pillows off the couch. Where am I going to sit? I don't need a pillow. 270 pounds, 6'2". I don't need a pillow. Jeez. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, did that light bulb go off? Why is that on? Oh, that's that. Oh, this is for this. Oh, look. Whoa, look at that. You can do an operation here. The only thing missing is a straight back chair. You won't be able to torture anybody in this room. What's over here? A little nightstand. Oh, nothing in there. No Bible. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed it. It's uh, 182 US dollars for this room on the app Hotel Tonight. Check it. I got into it. I put it on one of my icons of my phone. This is the first time I utilized it. And I can't tell you I'm not a satisfied customer. For New York City on Fifth Avenue for 182 dollars, US dollars a night. I think I did okay. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Tomorrow's Father's Day. When this loads and goes up, it'll probably be uh, Christmas. <laughs>